DJI, a brand globally recognized for revolutionizing drone technology and gimbal stabilization, is now rumored to be preparing one of its boldest moves yet, stepping into the competitive world of mirrorless cameras. The anticipated DJI mirrorless camera, which has generated a considerable buzz across photography and tech forums, could potentially challenge industry titans like Sony, Canon, Nikon, Panasonic, and Fujifilm, all of whom have spent decades refining their mirrorless ecosystems. But while some may question how a company known for aerial imaging can break into a market so deeply entrenched in optical tradition, others recognize DJI's clear strengths. Cutting-edge innovation, deep integration of hardware and software, and an uncanny ability to disrupt markets through aggressive feature sets and competitive pricing. According to early leaks and speculation, DJI's new mirrorless system may feature a full-frame sensor, a surprising yet logical move for a brand that already co-owns and collaborates with Hasselblad, a legendary name in medium-format imaging. Such a sensor, if developed in partnership with Hasselblad, would not only bring top-tier image quality, but also carry a level of prestige that instantly elevates DJI's position in the professional photography market. Combined with DJI's industry-leading video expertise, sharpened by years of creating cinema-grade drones and gimbals like the Ronin series, this rumored mirrorless camera could be designed as a hybrid powerhouse tailored for both high-end photography and advanced video production. The sensor, widely speculated to be a backside illuminated full-frame CMOS, might feature resolutions in the 33MP to 50MP range, capable of handling both detailed stills and oversampled 4K or even 6K and 8K video recording. Paired with DJI's likely inclusion of in-body image stabilization IBIS, possibly utilizing advanced algorithms derived from the company's gimbal heritage, the camera could deliver exceptionally smooth handheld footage and tack sharp stills, even at slower shutter speeds. This would immediately make it appealing to a broad range of users, from run and gun filmmakers and YouTubers to studio photographers and event shooters. There's also talk of a modular body design, echoing the flexibility of the DJI Ronin 4D ecosystem. This approach would give users the option to build the system they need, whether they're mounting the camera on a drone, rigging it for cinema, or traveling light with a minimalist setup. Such modularity could include interchangeable grips, external monitor modules, XLR audio interfaces, or even a separate recording unit to offload high bitrate footage, mirroring how RED, Zcam, and Blackmagic design their cameras for flexibility. Another critical aspect is lens compatibility. For a new system to thrive, it needs either a strong native lens lineup or a smart solution for adapting existing glass. While DJI could launch a proprietary lens mount, Insiders speculate that the camera may use a variant of the L-mount from the Leica Panasonic Sigma Alliance or even allow native E-mount support to tap into Sony's vast lens ecosystem. However, DJI's relationship with Hasselblad might lead them to develop a brand new mount optimized for both photography and high-speed, high-resolution video. To bridge the early gap in lens availability, DJI would likely release lens adapters with full electronic support for Canon EF, Nikon F, and Sony E lenses, giving users immediate flexibility. Given DJI's established presence in both drone and action camera markets, they already have experience with compact yet optically precise lens designs, which could translate well into a robust mirrorless lens roadmap. There's even a possibility that the company will lean into the hybrid shooter demographic by offering power zoom lenses, parfocal cine lenses, and fast primes optimized for both stills and video autofocus performance. Speaking of autofocus, DJI is expected to incorporate a cutting-edge hybrid autofocus system, combining phase detection and contrast detection with AI-powered subject tracking. Drawing from the subject tracking algorithms seen in DJI drones and the Pocket series, this autofocus system could feature eye tracking, animal detection, vehicle recognition, and intelligent zone focus modes, all of which are must-haves in today's fast-paced creative workflows. Video shooters may particularly benefit from DJI's potential focus pulling tools and programmable rack focus features, possibly controlled via a mobile app or wireless controller, a nod to DJI's history in remote camera operation. 
connectivity is also a likely highlight. DJI has shown its strength in creating integrated ecosystems with seamless app-based control, wireless live streaming, and real-time preview capabilities. The DJI mirrorless camera could come equipped with Wi-Fi 6E, Bluetooth 5.3, full-size HDMI output, dual CFexpress Type-B card slots, and native integration with the DJI MIMO or Ronin apps. Live streaming features, cloud sync, FTP upload, and camera to cloud solutions could make it especially appealing for content creators who value mobility and real-time workflows. On the video front, DJI is expected to deliver nothing short of cinematic excellence. The camera may offer 10-bit 4, 2, 2 internal recording, support for D-Log and HLG profiles, and even Pro's RAW or Cinematic external recording via USB-C or HDMI to Atomos or Blackmagic recorders. Given DJI's partnership with Apple and previous Pro's integrations in the Ronin 4D, this isn't far-fetched. Internal ND filters, like those in the Ronin 4D, could also make an appearance, revolutionizing how mirrorless users work in bright conditions. High frame rate options such as 120fps in 4K or 240fps in Full HD would add serious versatility for slow motion storytelling. Heat dissipation has been a persistent issue in mirrorless cameras, especially during prolonged 4K or 8K recording. DJI, having mastered thermal engineering in their drones and gimbal systems, might implement an active cooling system with silent fans and heat sinks that allow for unlimited recording times in most conditions, one of the key features that elevated the Ronin 4D above competitors. Battery performance is another likely strength. DJI could introduce a new intelligent battery system, possibly leveraging USB-C PD fast charging, hot swappable modules, or even a proprietary smart battery grip. With creators shooting in demanding conditions, DJI's history of developing long-lasting and efficient power solutions could give this mirrorless camera a real-world advantage over power-hungry competitors like the Canon R5 or Sony A1. When it comes to durability, DJI is known for building rugged equipment, and the mirrorless camera will likely follow suit. Expect weather sealing, magnesium alloy construction, and reinforced ports designed to withstand the rigors of both outdoor exploration and professional studio use. The potential impact of DJI's mirrorless camera on the market could be huge. For years, Sony and Canon have dominated hybrid mirrorless sales, with Nikon and Panasonic trailing behind despite releasing capable models. But DJI brings something different, vertical integration, software-hardware synergy, and a proven track record of shaking up stagnant categories. When DJI entered the drone market, it quickly outpaced competitors like Parrot and Unique. When it introduced the Osmo Action Series, it forced GoPro to rethink its product strategy. With a mirrorless camera, DJI is poised to disrupt again, not just with specs, but with a creator-first philosophy, modular flexibility, and AI-infused usability that could appeal to both high-end professionals and advanced enthusiasts. Pricing will play a major role. If DJI launches the camera around the $2,499 to $3,499 mark, it could sit between Sony's A7 IV and Canon's R5, offering a premium experience at a lower price point than flagship models. A more cinema-focused variant could also be released later, echoing Sony's FX3 or Canon's C70, giving users a roadmap for growth within the DJI system. Of course, challenges remain. Breaking into the mirrorless market means more than just releasing a good camera, it requires long-term support, firmware updates, customer service, repair networks, and a commitment to expanding the lens ecosystem. DJI must also ensure that its new system plays well with third-party accessories like gimbals, monitors, cages, and wireless transmitters used in professional workflows. But DJI has shown that it listens to feedback and adapts rapidly. If it can replicate the ecosystem synergy of its drone and gimbal lines in the mirrorless space, it won't be long before photographers and videographers alike are rethinking brand loyalty. In a world where content creation is increasingly mobile, digital, and AI-assisted, DJI's fresh approach could set a new standard for what a modern mirrorless camera should be.